that as educators, we've all had a that kid, right? It's the one, it's the kid that other teachers or teachers in the previous grade will come up to you and say, oh, you have that kid? Mm. Let me tell you. And, and you know what? I do this in professional development. I often tell, um, we do a series, a session called 360 Relationships. Mm-hmm. And one of the last points you talk about is give them space to grow. Yeah. Give people space to grow. That could be your coworkers, that can be family members, and that needs to be students as well. Yeah. Because sometimes, like you said, the fourth grade teacher will tell the fifth grade teacher, fifth grade teacher tell sixth grade teacher. Yeah. And I get there's information we need to pass on to the next grade. I get that. Sure, sure. But of unfortunately, sometimes we label that child mm-hmm. and we don't give them space to grow. Yeah. And because over the between the fourth and fifth grade, they can do some maturing. They can they do some can. growing. And we don't we want that for them. We do. Yeah. Um, but unfortunately, we label them and now we may enter that kid and he's always going to be that kid. Exactly. And we have to give them space to grow because we're not the same people we were either.